I haven't seen you for a while. It's good to have you back. Yeah, I'm not even remotely convinced. Anyway, I got things to be doing, people to be killing. I think she might have been right in some respects. I have have um waited a while before continuing this. You? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Hey, it's jump scare lady. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. And hiding just to stay alive, that's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. I understand how you feel. I'm gonna say I'm not sure we whether I'd call this freedom or not. Did. I came to Jericho looking I mean, for hope. You know. It's like you're free to walk about the Looks old like boat. I'm not gonna find any here. I mean if if you consider that freedom, then all the better for Just you. Just like the but... rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. Let's deal with it. You're safe here. Through the medium of violence. You can stay with us as long as you want. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe maybe I'm being a bit premature here. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Oh, right, yeah. He did get a bit injured, didn't he? Back in the junkyard. Um... Now you look pretty beep boop. You're a beat up beep boop. The diagnostic program isn't working. <laughs> I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. Yeah, diagnostic program. Oh, the program says you're fucked. They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. I don't want to shut down. Classic humans. No, Always causing mass amounts of cruelty and pain for the sake of fun. Don't worry, we're not like them. We'll kill them quickly. Ooh, barrel. Start fire, yes please. Yeah, uh, there we go. Like moths to the flame. Burn. Burn. This doesn't look like a lightable barrel. Give me a moment. Over here, this one will. Burn! Are there any more things I can set on fire? I guess not. What's your deal then? I've heard humans are afraid of dying too. Well, that would be um, normal, yes. Do you know what happens after death? After? There is no after. No. No, I don't. If there was any after, it wouldn't be death. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. Yeah, that's his slave name. He's awfully clean, isn't he? I was glad to meet you, Marcus. I mean, he was doing all sorts of parkour with those hands before. And they're still... Completely pristine, clean, white, under all the um, magical skin illusion stuff. Can we push her over? Uh, apparently bumping into her does nothing, she's completely static now. Ooh. What's going on? Uh, uh... Are you Lucy? The hell? Lady! You're missing half your head. Sit down. I think you're missing a lot more than half of your head. What is her deal, anyway? Show me. Is 
He could have at least specified what he was to show her. I'll stop the bleeding. I guess Marcus is psychic or something, or maybe they're just like networked via Wi Fi. Yeah, I'm sure that'll make you really relatable to the humans. Drink this. The hell? There's metal parts on it. It's got printed directly on the bottle. This is one over-engineered bottle. She's got weird makeup. As well as... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Some of those cables weren't even attached to anything. Give me your hand. Just take your hand off. Disconnect your hand. No, come on. That would have been the total funny answer. Just pull your hand out of its socket and pass it to her. Yes, we get it. You've got black eyes. Woo, so spooky. And you lost it all. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail. Did you used to work at a carnival or something, lady? Your choices will shape our destiny. I guess that's where the, where you got lobotomized. Anyway, this has been a delightful waste of time. Ah, what's the deal with these crates? They're empty. Okay. Great. The spiky things in them. I'm supposed to... Um, yeah, see? We got an address. Now we've got something to do. Yeah, you, you just do your calculating. Propose a plan to Simon. Were you Simon? Hey, Simon the digger, Simon. wake up. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife warehouses in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. Yeah, who the we hell do you think weapons. I am? And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we he need. Here's Marcus no longer. Fight. Now we'll he just is... get ourselves killed. Tamina. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. Come on. Okay. We're not Jericho anymore. We're yeah. Team Digurin. Let's go. Eh, now where are we? You're gonna be okay? Oh, please don't tell me this is the chapter I think it is. Oh, God, I hate this chapter. Keep mashing that bell. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Yes, he must be a pedophile. Come on, let's go, bait. Come on in. Don't be shy. 
Ah, yes, this building isn't remotely ominous, is it? Okay. Why why is it blurry? Stop being blurry. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. And he probably has a monster cock. And he fucks you up the ass with it. <laughs> Please. Make yourselves at home. It makes you feel like a little child. Since you can't find any little children of your own. Isn't that right, Slutko? How did you hear about me? <laughs> that painting! An android. <laughs> On the oh, Jesus. you could help us. Haunted house painting much. I see. Deviant, huh? What about her? She also has a Deviant art account. She's human. <laughs> really? You think? And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air. Can't start and a campfire no there. Like if, you try to, if you try to start a campfire on a beach in Canada, the police will yes, drop by and arrest you for it, or at least give you a warning. That's exactly what we want. Of course. Very polite warning. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. Is that what Alice is? I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Alice, you're the tracker. Come on. Follow me. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. Right, right this way. Everything we need is in the basement. Yes, let's go into your nasty, dark, and dangerous. Du Whoa, what's this? Okay, it's nothing. Let's go into the dungeon. What could possibly go wrong down here? I don't like this place and that man. Yeah, it's I know. I have a bad feeling. I would love to. I know. I don't trust him either. <laughs> we have to be careful. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet right. from my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. No, we're, we're sure you just have all of these cages in this, this flipping way, dungeon for funsies. Not at all ominous. Oh, oh, well. Oh, wow. Look at this. Looks like Sadako could come crawling out of it at any second. If you could just stand over there. Okay. I will put myself into the torture device. Or I will put her into the torture device. I'm not quite sure on my viewpoint in these games. I, I mean, not myself, you. but this I'm also the character I'm playing as, right? Oh! <laughs> ah, yes, the pole for poking her in the back. Very important. Hello. You know what's strange? You? Me? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. She never worked. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah. Uh, people believe what they want. You Deviants are so naive. Yeah, let's just just pretend that, that I came them. down here because I wasn't railroaded just into it. Reset them, sell them on, or I keep them for my little experiments. No, no, I, I don't want to be reset. Let me go. Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. 
Uh, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant. Attico, now would be a good time for you to crawl out that's, of that well. That's so sweet. And so deluded. <laughs> I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Oh, uh, don't worry. You'll get yours. Yeah, I hate waiting for um for installation or uninstallation too. It's what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way. Tears and disillusionment. And everything on fire. Believe me. You're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. No more hopes dashed. He's not wrong. I almost envy you. Carl! Oh, don't worry. <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, what happened to you? <laughs> oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. What happened? You bit me. Alice, don't forget to wash your mouth. Bitch. Carl, wake up, Ugly Carl. fat men like him carry diseases. Anyway. Oh, are you going to rape me? Meet me in the living room. Okay, you're not going to rape me. Good. It's good. I, I, I didn't want that. La 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 la. What can I do with... Oh, hello. Let's destroy things. Uh, what's this? Vodka? Uh, green cable. I don't know why green cable. Reasons, probably. And I... Pull! Up to the vodka! Can we summon Sadako yet? Okay. Oh wow, this looks like it would be really painful. I never checked. Can she even feel pain? Karchan, do you feel pain? Oh, well, that's convenient. Hey, Sadako. Okay, I guess she's not there. Hold on. Oh, look, there's someone in there. Hello? Help us. Okay. Yay, let's free them all. What? What, it, what? Or is this a bad idea? I didn't ask. I didn't ask. But who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. It's like it's the real question is why? Really, I I don't. Well, you said for his amusement, but. Personally, I don't find this terribly amusing, just a bit weird. Anyway, where was I? Luther! Luther! Yes, Lako. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Understood, Lako. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. I'm just gonna straight up walk up the stairs. Are they blind? Ooh, what's in here? What's this? Holy shit, it's a bear! It's a 
Robo bear. Neat. Let the bear out. What could possibly go wrong? Oh. Bear doesn't want to come out. Okay. Bear likes his nice safe cage. Da -da -da. What's in here? What are you doing here? Has the master authorized you to be here? You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. You should not be here. You have no business here. No, you have nothing. Yeah, don't mind me. I'm just, I'm just ignoring everyone and wandering around. Ooh, what's in here? What, a magazine? No, no, I don't, I don't think I have time to be reading a magazine. Put the magazine down. Ooh, treasure chest! Can I, I can't open the treasure chest. Okay. Car chat! Around the side of the... What's this? <gasps> Shotgun! It's not loaded. Ah, oh, bollocks! Are there no shells anywhere? Oh! Fire! I like fire. No, 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 you're supposed to... Oh, God damn it. Why would she just examine the stick? What's over there? A Detroit supermarket was held up at gunpoint last night. Oh, yeah, that was me. I did that. reports that he was attacked by a young woman in the company of a little girl. I don't think she wants to be reminded. Anyway, doesn't matter. Next door. It occurs to me I'm being awfully nonchalant about this. But who cares? That's fine, isn't it? Hey, Cracker, I found you. Yeah, as if we had any choice. Come on. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Da da da. Luther. Oh, quick! Let's go in here. Hide. Suppose we could hide. I'm finished here. Quick! Let's hide under the table. Right away, sir. Start go. Hee <laughs> hee. Why can't it just disappear? It's gotta be here somewhere. What are you waiting for? Go look. Hmm. Oh, there's a shadow there. Can't see anything though. Oh wait, is that a leg? That's legs. He's got to look under the table. Luther, what the fuck are you doing? Come here. Coming. Bye bye, Luther. Oh, shit. Damn it, no! No, no, no. <laughs> Damn it, I wanted to set the plate on fire. No, stop, 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 stop. This is your story chart. It shows what parts of the story you've explored and what parts you've missed. You can track the choices made by other players and do many other things besides. You can use this chart to replay from any point in the story, but the people who designed me recommend that you play through at least once without going back, no matter what happens. God damn it! I can't... Either way, it's your story. Okay, if I want to set fire to the house, I have to go back to the start of the chapter. Oh, you absolute bastard. Vodka spilt!
Car Chen freed. Freaks released. Robo Bear released. Fire checked. I mean, let's be real. This scene wouldn't exist if the fire wasn't something you could actually use. So not using the fire would basically be a crime. Alice retrieved. Car, you remember me? I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. This time we must not fuck up the hiding. What? We'll hide in here instead. I can't have just disappeared. Gotta be here somewhere. What are you waiting for? Go look! We must not screw up the hiding. Under any circumstances. Or we'll have to do this all over again. Oh look, we can see him. He looks like he's about ready to give us a kickstand interrogation. Okay, don't release too early. Listen. Was that the door? I think that was the door. Okay, hold on. Take log. Oh yes, yes, yes. Right, what can we burn? We can burn this. Yay! <laughs> Smell it, we're going. Uh, let's just, just just go to the corridor. There's smoke everywhere. <laughs> Luther! There's a fucking fire! Luther! Oh! That was convenient timing. Let's go! There's a bear and zombies and fire. I think we've sufficiently destroyed this guy's place now. Thought that shotgun wasn't loaded. Let's go out back. We should have taken that flaming stick with us, honestly. No, it's raining. How can we expect to properly? Oh, Smell us, you're so useless. Go, Alice. No, I won't leave. Go. Oh, seriously, are, you, you are we seriously going to have this situation? Seriously. I warned you. You should have just picked her up and Dreams carried her. Always end in tears. You should have listened to me. And your house ends in fire. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. Ooh. How dare you. Oh, here come the zombies. You. What are you doing? Who let you out? Get away from me. Get away from Where's me. Where's the bear anyway? Obey me. I'm your master. <laughs> I'm your master. Like that ever works. Okay, bye bye, zombie friends. Yeah, unfortunately, the fire's not really going to last, is it? Please don't rape us. You're very large. I didn't want to hurt you. Okay. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Okay, nobody asked. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. Well, isn't that convenient? I could take I could protect you. You and the little one. You want some of that, don't All you, right. Car Chan? I 
trust you. You want his monster schlong, don't you, Karchan? Or maybe you just want to play Happy Families. Who knows? Can we just... Oh, there's the bear. Hi, friend bear. Bye, friend bear. Connor time, is it? Cool. Um, wrong hand, Connor. It's for left hand. Hello, Amanda. Hey, old lady. Hi, I've been expecting you. You got squares stuck you on your everything. I think I think Amanda likes post-it notes a little bit too much. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Which one? A pity you didn't manage to capture it. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Maybe you should consider replacing me. Did you manage to learn anything? I think we learned something. I can't really remember. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. Kind of impressive that what it else? could encrypt a paper book like that. Um, the walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths. Oh, yeah, it said rag symbols. everywhere, didn't it? Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. Rag. You came very close to capturing that deviant. Yeah, but we. How is your relationship with the lieutenant? We got to keep him alive. That's the point. He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. Yeah, we kept the Hank alive, didn't we? Didn't we? We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. You look pretty deviant we yourself. Need to stop this. You're Whatever it takes. Covered in post-it notes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. Nah. -ha -ha. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Ooh, more fun things to investigate, eh? Yeah, I, I've not been in the best way lately. Got a lot of pains and stuff. So, um... Okay. Okay. Is this Hanky Spanky's house? Lieutenant Anderson! Must be. Anybody home? No, we're not obnoxious at all. Oh well. Let's check all the windows and act like a creepy stalker. Oh! It's the doggo! Hi, doggo! His name was, um, Sumo, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Eh? Okay, there's two windows here. Uh, oh! There's Hanky Spanky. Lieutenant Anderson! Let's smash his window. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Ah, Connor. Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Anky Spanky, while I fully endorse um, and heroing yourself. It's kind of irresponsible to do it when you've got a dog to take care of, okay? Uh, how am I supposed to... There we go. Let's 
scotch. Not bad. Revolver. One bullet remaining. Light arrhythmia. He tried to shoot himself while drunk and missed because he's super drunk. Lieutenant. Wake up, Lieutenant. Harder. There we go. It's me, Connor. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. Screw I'm you, sorry, beep boop. Lieutenant, but I need you. You need to take care of your dog. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. Come on. Hey. Up we go. Sulu, attack. Woof. Good job. Attack. Uh, he doesn't need fuck, to attack. We're friends. That's okay. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. Listen, Hanky Spanky, if you kill yourself here, I'm the one who's going to have to take care of your dog. Uh, I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. Um, it's for your own good. This isn't actually going to remove the alcohol from his system. I think I should just point that out. Making him... Making him wet is not, in fact, going to uh, make him less drunk. What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> <laughs> Can't you just leave me alone? Connor is an awesome, creepy stalker. Anyway, uh... Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should... Beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! Yeah, you need to sit down. <laughs> Let's tease him. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. Okay. I'll go get them. Oh, is this it? What do you want to wear? Whatever. Okay, which is the freakiest? Hippie, strippy, Streaky. Streaky? Let's get streaky. <coughs> I got you some streaky clothing. You're right, Lieutenant. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. I get it. He just needs to reverse drink. <laughs> The toilet wants some vodka too. I mean, not vodka, whiskey. President Warren issued an official warning to Russia in her speech to Congress today, where she demanded that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic Jazz. region immediately. The Kremlin has yet to respond. I thought he listened to metal. I guess he listens to everything. Many experts are suggesting the specter of a third world war draws close. Hey, Sumo. Are you a good boy? Yes, you're a good boy, aren't you, Sumo? You're a very large good boy. Who's a good dog? Who's a good dog? It's you. It's you, Sumo. Now, who would this be? Ah. Dead son. Okay, well, that's... Good to know, I guess. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Well, I wanted to see how long I could last. 
Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. No, I think he was unlucky. Sumo was lucky. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Sumo will always be a good boy. Bye bye, Sumo. Uh -huh, what's this? This is crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Okay, so we're raiding the warehouse. Come on, move. Move, Kamina. Don't believe in yourself. Believe in the me who believes in you. Or something like that. Don't let them see us. Okay. So, how do I not let them see us? Watch out. Now what do we do? I'll find another way. This is some pretty, like, easy parkour at this stage, isn't it? Okay. Wait, where are we going? We're taking the scenic route. Can we drop it on him? Come on, let's just shake it a bit. Well, that's boring. What are we going to do about the um, glowy thing? Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. Oh. Is it time for some fancy acrobatics, is it? Okay, no, no, let's do it properly. Pre-construct. <laughs> What's with this monkey flip? That's it. Reject humanity. Return to monkey. And actually, I don't think you can do it since you were never a monkey because you're a beep boop robot, but still. Return to beep boop monkey. Robo monkey or something. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Return to spirit job, monkey? Keith. Punch ghosts? No. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Okay, uh, right. What's in here? Glowy things. What is it? We got a visitor. You were trespassing on private property. Hi. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. Please don't. John! God damn machine! You know we're gonna have to kill John for you. Kill God, yes please! What are you doing? I told you to. <laughs> yes! <laughs> We've killed our first meat bag! What? Josh is hostile! What? Don't tell me you didn't want to cleanse the meat bags! Let's finish up and get out of here! Come on! Find some blue blood. Judge me! Enough. I mean, it was a clean kill. It wasn't all that fun, I guess. Could have done with spraying blood everywhere, but... You know, we might do with what we can. 
Maybe we'll get to kill more meat bags later. Oh. Well, might as well wake them up. They can come with us. I don't think they have much choice in the matter. You could join us. What's he doing? Oh, is that all you need to do? You just touch them and use your Robo Jesus powers. By the almighty power of beep boop, awaken! Yeah, you might want to cover that up. There we go. She's impressed now. Oh, oh she likes it when I'm waking up Android. She doesn't like it when I'm um, cleansing the meat. Harry, let's go. Take me with you. Okay. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. He's a beep boot robot. He comes with us. Too dangerous. They come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. Oh, cool. What do you mean? See, I knew that would be helpful. The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. Or I could kill them. Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. There's a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. It might not be an opportunity to kill them. I don't know, though. Let's do it. Wait here. If I'm not back in ten minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No. I'm going alone. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. Come on, just go through the goddamn fucking window. The controls are so janky sometimes. Who's oh, he's got blood on his hand, that's cool. I like these little details. Goddamn dogs. What the fuck are they barking at? Could be the weather. They don't like storms. Yeah, I was gonna take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Is Mike still in zone four? Looks like it. And he should be done already. Better off in here than out patrolling in that. <gasps> What's this? What's this? Ooh, gun! Short circuit? Yay! Destroy! Oh, what? No, no, I want to use the gun. <sighs> Whatever. Fuses are over there. I don't know shit about electricity. And I don't get paid to fix fuses. Let's just flip the switch. That doesn't work. We can call maintenance. Just... Oh, well, I didn't get to kill them. I got the key, at least. That's something. Did you get it? Ah, oh, turns out his hand's a skeleton key. Hurry! Who knew? And away we go. I really should have grabbed that gun somehow. Oh well. 
If it had been a flamethrower, I would have reset the stage to grab it. You know I would have. A truckload! We stole a whole truckload! We got bio components for everybody. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I'm Kamina now. Marcus is my slave name. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Hey, don't diss living in the free dark. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. I like living in the dark. I live in the dark. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile. Or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not going to take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. And we'll kill them. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah! Okay, let's cleanse the meat. To be honest, Car Chan's in the lead for killing people so far. I think. Has Connor killed anyone? I don't remember. <laughs> the blood. <laughs> Hells yes. Right, well, um... I think that's a nice result. I only wish I could have killed more meat bags. Uh, avoid guards. I bet I bet there's another route here that uh, I don't know. I'm not seeing any route that leads to killing the guards, so maybe it wasn't possible in the first place. Anyway, I will wrap this up here. And sorry for not making this video sooner, but I have had a bad time the past few days, so well, the past week or so. So, um, yeah. Thank you and good night.